Hi, my name is Isaiah. I'm going to be doing a poem that I wrote. This poem is titled An Unlocked Door. So here we go. <clears throat> door. D O O R. Door. When you look at a door, what's the first thing that comes across your mind? Is it how far you come to get to the door or what lies on the other side? Do you have praises on your tongue because you know this door is meant for you? Or do you doubt the fact that it even unlocked because of the things you've been through? You see, so many times we have doors that are meant for us. But yeah, we get scared and discouraged because we see that there's a key we need. When reality is, anything that has something valuable on the other side has a lock to it. Or some form or some shape to where the devil or the enemy can't get through it. But no one look at the outside appearance and say, oh, I've come too far. You know, I don't have a key, so I guess this door is just not meant for me. So we fall back into those same old traps when all we need to do is look under that doormat. See, because where the doormat is, the key lies. See, but this doormat comes in all forms, shapes, and size. This doormat doesn't say home, sweet home, or welcome. See, no, this doormat says Jesus. You know, the forgive of all those broken leases, Jesus. The one that can take place of any missing puzzle pieces, Jesus. But so often we just stop in on him and try to bogart in. But not once do we stand still and say, Lord, we thank you for this opportunity that you've given. Not once do we say, Lord, I'm standing on you and I'm standing on your word. So even if this door doesn't open, I know that you have another one. Because I walk by faith, not by sight. And faith doesn't stand by the wisdom of man, but by the power of Jesus Christ. So yeah, it may seem that I don't have the key. But that can only mean that I need to take inventory. So here, let's start with the letter D. D stands for direction. Did I ask God to guide my every footstep? Because I know he will only order them in his perfection direction. Direction. O stands for obey. Did I obey his every word? Because if I did, I can truly say that this door is meant for me. And that can only mean this next O means opportunity. Because if I ask him to guide my every step and I obey his every word, and I ended up at this door that just has to mean God set some things in order. So here I stand with this door in front of me. So what could R, what could R possibly mean? By faith, I will turn this door and I've been see, because see, R. R means revealing. Revealing to me that God is the key and he is everything I need. See, RR is revealing. Revealing the many blessings God already had in store for me from the beginning. See, RR is revealing. Revealing what God is able to do whenever I trust and believe. See, RR is revealing. Revealing that in 2017, God is truly able to do exceedingly. So by faith, I will walk into this door, into my purpose, to my destiny, with my hands lifted up, saying to God, be the glory. Thank y'all for watching. Um... Like, share, and subscribe, and, um, you know, if this poem encourages you, if any of my poems encourage you in any way, just comment, you know, feel free to comment with how you feel and all of that, so thank y'all for watching, and have a blessed day.